Bruh. Now this one who drops 30 kills every game in bot what? lobbies was caught 30 kills you deadass right now hiding in a corner behind a trophy killing people in the back as they come in If I ever get this bad at Call of Duty shoot me <laughs> She sat there for ages it was embarrassing no. She would rather put no on a way. gas mask and play like a rat. You're just jealous of my success, Call of Shame. Mm -mm. Rat by shooting people in the back. Pathetic. Shooting people in the back. Damn. So shooting people in the back. Crazy, man. She like, I'm strong. I'm independent. Dazzle princess. This is the same one that was caught teaming in my previous video. And then demanded she wants the money from the tournament split as she has to pay her rent. Bruh. Massive cash payouts are being paid out to these Warzone streamers so they don't have to get a job. No. Before I got rent to pay, come on now. Come on, Call of Shame. She got rent to pay, dog. She at least she's not doing OnlyFans, bro. There's swag out there who likes to. <laughs> Let's be real, bro. Let's keep a buck fifty. But today, my brothers, we are gonna be doing some therapy. You do not have to flip the camera around. I got you, my brothers. We're gonna be doing some therapy. We're gonna be catching them cheaters. Get your foot pedals, get your fat doobies, and guys, like and subscribe, and let's get into the story. Have here. no integrity. Well, it just goes from bad to worse. I wanna see them Here's cheaters. Huskers bro. exploiting live on stream. Why studios are obsessed with these streamers amazes me. As the rat gets to work with his shameful behavior, performing the gas mask duplication cheat to spawn multiple gas masks to assist him in his games. The simps watch on in amazement. They will also be exploiting like huskers, as now, they know exactly how to do it. Yo, would you consider this cheating? One if yes, two if not? It's a duplication glitch though, uh, it's a glitch, it's an exploit, I do agree, but like, damn though, like, it's just maskless uh, glitch. Wait. Nowadays we call everything cheating though, that's, a, that's the point we got to, but I don't blame anybody that would call this cheating. Cause the cheaters have gotten so wild, like this game is infested with cheaters bruh! But this is an exploit, in my opinion. Oh, damn. Oh, my God. Okay, maybe Call of Shame has a point, then. Maybe he has a point? I mean, one or two masks, I, I wouldn't view that as cheating. I would say, yeah, it's a glitch. Damn. Okay, guy got, like, the entire colony of masks. Bro, I remember during the, like... During the Ronnie situation, I know suckers were selling one mask for two, three dollars, sometimes even five dollars. And this thing is hoarding the mask, bro. God damn, this guy got entire colony worth full of masks, bro. That's, that's insane. Symphony wants the interceptor nerfed. Symphony. You see, the streamers are getting absolutely tormented with it, but they can't use it because it requires a skill level. I'm, no way, dude. I was really chat. I'm getting fucking three bulleted, dude. Yeah. No. Oh, dude, you guys gotta fucking fix your guns, bro. Look at this shit. Three yep, bullets. that's what I'm saying too, bro. Oh my god. Fix your shit, bro. For real. For real, bro. Yeah, Call of Duty, just fix your game, bro. Like, see, I'm having a hard time getting kills in your game, bro. Yesterday, I was able to cheat. I was... <laughs> I was able to get them 10, 20, 30 kills in a game, bro. And now my cheats are not working, bro. Call Call of Duty, fix your game, bro. I wasn't reading the chat, damn it. It's your shit. This, this is getting absurd. There is nothing is. to fix. Maybe a skill issue? This is a weapon of my choice, and I call it... The nah, Call of Shame, you're just jealous. Streamer Let's killer. First, Streamer make sure killer? you select the MTZ Interceptor from the Marksman category. Now, ignore all this meta nonsense that streamers love to claim regarding suppressors. Everything needs to be on vertical recoil and gun kick. You want this gun ready for follow-up shots. Dude, I love the Call of Shame tips and tricks and best class glass <laughs> best class setups, but my guy, I don't even have the game, bro. I really got <laughs> I don't have the game, damn it, I don't have it. My though. problem. These people that pre-arranged to run around as a team of eight should have the prize money revoked. The money should be given to charity. This is absolutely crazy. You are not allowed to share out the prize pool. Every one of these streamers behaved shamefully. If this money is not returned, this has to be one of the biggest scams for a major tournament I have ever seen. What an absolute joke. Activision need to step up and sort this they out. They need to step up, but they won't. Be like, 
come on, Call of Shame. She needs the money, bro. She needs it for her BBL therapy. Bruh. Like, come on, man. At least they're like, you know, uh, giving money to their their homies, to their cheaters. I mean, what they say, right? What they say all the time. Cheaters gotta stay together. They gotta stay together. Cheating, you feel what I'm saying? Needs for the BBL, was hosted bro. By Optic, but they still need the green light from Activision. You can't split prize money. What are you clowns doing? Alright, we're playing it, fellas. <laughs> hey, yes, I'm going sir. Let's go! That was great. Yo, Dab, that was good, good assemble in the squad. Breadman was also pre-arranging a team before the game. As he attempts to count from 1 to 7, it's always the same old faces that feature on this. Damn, man, there is so much Bud Light up in here, guys. Like, that is crazy. Yeah, damn. <laughs> Guys, smash that like button and don't drink Bud Light, guys. It will, that's like it would change your gender, dog. Channel for cheating. Now we see them involved in more shady behavior. The rules clearly stated, if players wanted to form an alliance after the drop, they can. Because these are not professional players. They are just Warzone streamers, created to keep children occupied during lockdowns. Nothing more. It never said you could create a seven-man squad, prior to the game starting. And arranging to split prize money is absolutely disgraceful. We made a pact. There's seven of us on a team. It's me, Huskers, FIFA, Joe, Blue, Metaphor, and Skullface. If any of us win... Yo, where is Swag? You forgot Swag, bro. We're giving every other person 2.8k. Because that's basically 20k divided by as many of us there are. Damn, um, so they're getting 20k? Hey, yo, man, can a brother get, like, two pennies, though? Like, like that that's... That's all I'm asking, man. Can a brother get two pennies? And also, like, give, like, maybe 2k to Call of Shame as well, bruh. Man, come on, bro. Like, Call of Shame has been putting in work. He has been catching y'all burnas. He has been catching y'all asses cheating the game. He deserve it. In my honest opinion, Call of Shame deserve it, bro. He deserved that 2.8k, dog. He deserved that 2.8k. That you're Just forget about, like, one of the partners that you're gonna give to. You guys are saying you're gonna be dividing it by seven people, right? Oh, or how many, I'm not even sure. Uh, doesn't even make sense, right? Like 20 divided by, or maybe it makes sense, 2.8, yeah. It's like 10, divide, uh, 20 divided by 10 would be tw uh, 2,000. So 2.8, yeah, makes sense, okay? Give that to Call of Shame, and let me have that two pennies too, bro. And um, so, if any of us win- And also, two pennies to everybody who's gonna smash a like button as well. Cannot forget the homies are smash a like button, you know? You anyway, know we're splitting the money. Can you imagine how the administration teams feel like when they have to transfer funds and they see names like Biffle, Breadman or Huskers as a payee? But they can't say anything as these Warzone streamers will collectively attack them on social media to rally up a simp army. These sponsors need to man up and recover your money. Whatever sponsor gave away $200,000 to Warzone streamers, well, I bet you feel really silly now. These are Warzone streamers, what are you doing? You can't get any lower in society. This is the bottom of the barrel. Wow, Just wow, Call of Shame. Come on, da uh, damn, bro. Like, uh, ding, 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 time out, bro. Ding, ding, ding. Bro, come on, man. The disrespect is off the charts, bro. These are Call of Duty players, man. These are the the players off over society these are people first of all these are people off over society then players of the game and these are streamers professional they there's so much hassle involved first you gotta do your research trying to find like a good cheat that actually works good old and reliable right then you gotta read the instructions you gotta buy you gotta actually read instructions again because sometimes you forget how to cheat right it's complicated business bro so you buy it you read instructions then you apply it and sometimes it doesn't work and then you gotta ask for a refund and then you have to search for a new old reliable cheat manufacturer and then once you get it read instructions once again once again install it do, do this and that and it's a lot of hassle trying to hide cheating from the community from your community from the people from all also, you call of shame. Yeah, you, bro. These things are trying their absolute hardest, so you do not catch them cheating, bro. There's a lot of skill involved, bro. Like, come on, bro. Give some credit to these streamers, my my boy. Just look at them. They really have no respect for anything. What they want to do. What you looking at? Yo, that's Jeff. What's happening here? Uh, I'm joking. By the way, sarcasm for two people that didn't get it. Uh, also, this story is absolutely wild. So, this was a live uh, event, and during this live tournament, there was this streamer, I forgot, I don't know his name, he was watching the Bum Bum content? 
He was chasing the bomb bomb, Brad, live on. He was watching the hot tub streams on Twitch. Those of you that actually learned and done the research, you know what's going on. I mean, do not do your research on that kind of topic, guys. Come on, man. Let me do the research. I've done the research uh, for you guys, and uh, there are new rules. And apparently, this second was watching those hot tub streams live on live in a tournament. This, I mean, this is this was crazy though. Oh, who is that? Huh? He I don't blurred know who it. That was, but. I I don't know Jukies? Who that, is. that is a uh, that's a reindeer. Is it Jukies? Well, it's Jukies. Jukies. Huh. Come on, man. Look, well. at, look, Corey had to cover it up. <laughs> Two and sploosh. There you go. Yeah. She mind blown. She mind blown. Professional commentator oh side goodness. of 11 years is like, don't address that. Gaming dad and Warzone streamer Jukies has been banned for two months for his antics oh, on stream. Activision finally have had enough and banned Jukies from all official Call of Duty tournaments and events. <laughs> These streamers need to start taking some responsibility. This looks deliberate, designed for attention. It's time Activision cut these people loose, they are an absolute headache. Take a look at these people, all trying to justify oh, it's okay, to broadcast someone, who is an ex cam girl and current Twitch hot tub streamer live, during a Call of Duty event. Yeah, swag is like, wait, actually? <laughs> ah. Oh shit, he got banned, bro. Oh my bro. god, bro. He was chasing the pom pom and he got banned over that. And over here, I'm like, tick, 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 tick. damn, bro, that is crazy. Even Facewag is mind blown that he's not banned, but the, the other guy that, that was uh, chasing the burnout, chasing the pom pom, got banned. Though that is that is crazy. Oh. But I want to see like what happened next uh, to Yay. Strong independent guy, she back, she back, bro. He's strong independent queen's back, bro. But wait, what's this? The self-proclaimed best female Warzone player has returned, Nadia. That's right, I'm back. When the world needed her most, she returned, ladies and gentlemen. She's a beacon of hope. She's a beacon of light for all the strong independent queens. When we needed her most, she is back. I mean, Call of Shame would be like, this is business. The Like, she she uh, trying to revive the business of uh, cheating, though. Like, uh, she back. But damn, man, she also grew a mustache, which is just crazy. I mean, be strong independent, but don't be that strong independent, though, where you, like, grow a mustache, Nadia. Come on, man. You're like, you're a nine kitty player. We appreciate your skills, but like we don't want to see no mustache though like that when i become again the best female rebirth player and absolutely shit on every guy in the lobby again i, I really wonder what you guys will say that the anti-cheat doesn't work anymore nothing no. is going to go your guys's way mm. no matter what i'm still going to play how i used to play because i just simply was True. not good and that's just the reality Slay queen how do you guys have to face and Crazy man, this is absolutely crazy times we living in man strong independent stuff is getting out of hands right now But click on this video on the screen because dr. Disrespect friend was caught cheating in his lobby oh, shit. Oh, shit. Dead ass under God's hot sun check this video out and I will see you 